Michael and I are big fans of Jordan oh, Love, yeah. too. And enough talking about him, Michael. Why don't we talk to the guy oh. himself? Jordan, thank you so much for joining us here on Campus Insiders. We appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. All right, so let's talk about the, the big difference between last year and this year. You know, you slowly took over duties under center last year, and this year it is without a doubt your team. And the coaches have told me, as I've covered your games out there, that the transition that you have made as a leader has just been remarkable. For you, how has it been stepping into that leadership role, knowing that this is your team, these are your guys? Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit different, but I mean, uh, like I've been saying, I mean, when you back up, you prepare the same kind of like at the starter. So, I mean, finally getting in the game last year, I mean, it helped. And then it just helped transition into this year. And then I've had to step up a lot as a leader this year, um, just having that starting role. But. It's fantastic. Um, <laughs> speaking of fantastic, Chucky Keaton, big time player there for the Aggies. He's also on staff now. Let's talk about Chucky Keaton, what he means to you and how he kind of influences the way you play. Yeah, I mean, it's great having uh, Chucky as a coach up here, um, just having him on staff, having him on the sideline. I mean, he's a a lot of help. I mean, he's been through it. Uh, same stuff I'm going through right now. So, I mean, he knows what he's talking about. And uh, just having him on the sideline uh, just helped me after every play and stuff like that. Just helped me out on the sideline. I mean, it's a lot of help. Now, speaking of your coaching staff and the guys that you can lean on for support, what about your offensive coordinator, David Yost? He gets a lot of attention, you know, not just for this offense and the way you guys have been working it, but also what about that hair, that surfer guy, long blonde hair? I got to know, what is he like behind the scenes? What's your relationship like? Does he live up to that surfer guy thing? <laughs> no, nah, I mean, that's just, that's his hairstyle. I mean, he, he pulls it off, though. But, I mean, uh, he's, a, he's a great coach. I mean, I, I love having him as a coach. I mean, he knows what he's talking about. He knows his offense. I mean, he knows how to run it. And, I mean, just he's, he's a great person to have around. He, he has a lot of knowledge of it, so. Yeah. And then real quick, what is it like when you guys are on a bye week? What is it like for you on the bye week this week? Uh, I mean, it's just time to to rest your body. I mean, it's a it's a week you don't got a game, so you gotta got guys that's coming off injury and they're finally getting back. So I mean, it's just a kind of like a recovery week, but then it's also we got an extra week to prepare for uh, BYU coming up. So I mean, it helps. All right, well, enjoy that bye week, Jordan. Thank you so much for joining us here on Campus Insiders. We certainly appreciate it.